Okay. You guys ready? Let's get this started then. Time. Have you ever heard the line, it takes teamwork to make the dream work? Well, those are two things I want to tell you about today. The team and my dream. My dream is to improve coffee quality while bringing new perspectives as a coffee producer and barista. And I believe that is only achievable through teamwork. I'm going to start extracting your specials for your signature course, but please don't worry about this coffee yet. I'm going to tell you all about it in your milk course. The order of your drinks today will be espresso, milk, and signature beverage. And I'm so excited to share you with, with you the stream. But first, let's talk about how I got to the stream. My dream to improve coffee quality allowed me to meet some of the best coffee producers all over the globe. Landing especially in Panama this year. Visiting Panama was a true inspiration. And when Kai Jensen, the coffee producer, invited me to come taste and select coffees for Best of Panama, I learned how much Panama is a true symbol for the combination of terroir, varietal, and right processing techniques that truly elevate its coffee's qualities. That is why, starting with your espresso today, I'm gonna to be serving you a natural geisha, producing Jansen Los Alpes Estate in the region of Volcan at 1,700 meters. This coffee was carefully produced and meticulously picked, and then fermented anaerobically for 48 hours. Through its anaerobic fermentation process, Kai is able to create new organic volatile compounds. This will bring you today the flavors of mandarin orange and dark plum. After the fermentation process, these coffees go into unique dark rooms for their drying phase, drying at a consistent temperature of 18 degrees with 45% humidity for 13 days. By developing a unique drying profile for his coffees, Kai is able to preserve all those classical geisha notes of dark plum and orange blossom. Now being inspired by Kai's low temperature techniques, I'm gonna preserve your signature shots in my own dark room here in this hyper chiller. But we'll get to this in your signature course later. Now, let's move on to your espressos finally. I'm gonna be serving you espressos in a recipe of 22 grams in to 56 grams out. This is gonna bring you a medium body for weight today. Please look at the menu to your left. You have flavor notes for your espresso course and your milk course. I'm gonna be handing you a second menu in your signature course. Please feel free to take these menus with you afterwards. I'm gonna ask you please to take two sips of water now to fully cleanse your palate before your espresso courses. And please begin writing down the flavor notes of your espresso. You're gonna taste a medium to high acidity, like white wine. A medium sweetness, like fresh mandarin orange. And a pleasant medium bitterness, just like dark chocolate. You're gonna taste the flavors of mandarin orange, orange blossom, and dark plum. You will have a medium body for weight, silky and coating texture, and a pleasant, long-lasting dark chocolate finish. Now, being inspired by low temperature techniques and how to preserve more volatile compounds, I've decided to rapid chill your extractions. Rapid chilling allows us to preserve 40% more aromatic volatile compounds bringing higher flavor clarity to orange blossom and dark plum notes. Rapid chilling, as you can see here, is using frozen stainless steel spheres to quickly cool down the temperature of your extractions. And I love this technique because it creates such a memorable texture. Silky and coating espressos for you.
Now I'm gonna ask you not to drink these espressos yet. Please start only by evaluating the crema. Thank you. Now with Kai Jensen's teamwork in sharing unique knowledge about coffee processing, it's what inspired me today as your barista to share with you this amazing expression of geisha on espresso that was elevated using low temperature techniques. Now I'm gonna stir your espressos for you, but please wait, we're gonna enjoy these espressos together. For now, I wanna invite you to join our team and our dream of elevating coffee quality. You may now start enjoying these espressos. You guys ready? Now let's move on into your milk course. I'm gonna tell you how through teamwork we're gonna elevate your milk experience, especially because milk drinks are the gateway drink for new customers. And this is how we bring more people in, by creating delightful, sweet, dessert-like milk courses. So first with the coffees, together with Kai Jensen's teamwork, I was able to elevate a coffee producing my family farm back in Brazil at Fazenda Home. This natural pink bourbon underwent the same processing techniques and dark room drying, just like Kai taught us, elevating its sweetness and complexity. That's why I decided to blend this coffee for you today. In the composition of 70% Jansen Geisha to 30% Fazenda Home Natural Pink Bourbon. This is the ultimate teamwork in between coffees and producers to bring you a medium to high body and a beautiful sweetness to your milk course. Now, with the help of our team roaster, Paul Stevens, we developed a unique roast profile for both of these coffees in a fluid bed roaster with a halogen capability. With the halogen, we're able to fully develop these beans from inside out, bringing higher complexities and body. Also with the team, we have selected a zero lactose milk with 3% fat content that was freeze distilled to 30%. Zero lactose milk contains simple sugars that are more inclusive for new customers while elevating the sweetness of your milk course. In order to create that balance of milk and espresso, I'm gonna be serving you in a recipe of 25 grams of espresso to 50 grams of milk. Now, finally, with the help of our mixologist, Marcia Yoko, we selected a unique water for you today. Higher contents of calcium and magnesium to fully cleanse your palate and increase your flavor perception. Please go ahead and drink two sips now. After seeing how rapid chili greatly improves the texture and quality of your espressos, I've decided to test with milk. Freshly steamed milk needs to hit 58 degrees to break down the simple sugars and increase sweetness. But due to its high temperature, it oxidizes quickly creating unwanted flavors. That's why I rapid chill your milk from 58 to 50 degrees to preserve that sweetness and bring you more flavor clarity. I'm gonna ask you only to start inspecting the visuals. Don't drink your espressos, your milk courses yet. Please write down the flavor notes. You're gonna taste peach yogurt, melted chocolate ice cream. and creme brulee. Here you go. You're gonna have a medium to high body for weight, creamy, rich, and buttery mouthfeel. 
and a sweet melted chocolate ice cream finish. Thank you. Here you go. Now you have met all of our team members today, starting with Kai Jensen and my family, your coffee producers. Paul Stevens, your roaster. Marcia, our mixologist. And me as your barista. Bringing synergy to ingredients and techniques, elevating your coffee experience. Now I want to welcome you all into our team. I'm going to ask you to do your part now. I want you to use the clean spoons in front of you to stir your milk courses five times back and forth to fully incorporate the crema and enjoy your milk beverages. You may place clean spoons into the small pink cups in front of you. Ready? Now that you're all part of our team, let's make this dream come true. If there's something understood in this journey, is that the most important thing are the people around us and how they push us to fulfill our dreams. That's why I'm serving you today my dream. A natural pink bourbon that was elevated with Kai Jensen's teamwork, bringing you unique notes on espresso today of honey and orange blossom. I've decided to serve you this coffee today because it is our dream to elevate this coffee's qualities and bring you a unique flavor experience. Now in front of each of you, you have a unique ingredient that represents and celebrates each of our team members. Our industry starts with you representing our coffee producer. That's why you have 40 grams of a mixed syrup of peach, cherry, and lime. That was prepared by blending equal parts of water, fruit, and sugar. This represents our producer because it creates the base of fruit notes that normally come through fermentation transforming the orange blossom note today into grapefruit juice. Now you represent our roaster. That's why you have 20 grams of coffee oil sacrum. That was prepared by mixing equal parts of geisha spent pucks, sugar, and 100 grams of water. This represents our roaster because it creates complexity, body, and sweetness, bringing you and transforming that honey note into a dark chocolate note. Now you represent our mixologist. That's why you have 40 grams of a citrus infusion that was prepared with hot water, lemongrass, lemon and grapefruit peels. This represents our mixologist because it creates new aromatic compounds, bringing you my favorite note today of ginger ale. Now you represent our most important team member, the coffee consumer. That is why you're in that unique spot today because it is my job as your barista to showcase the entire industry through transparency, from seed to cup, while bringing new techniques that elevate your coffee quality. That's why you have 14 grams of fresh orange juice, because consumers are the ones that pushes us to innovate with simple ingredients, bringing you a juicy texture today. And I'm gonna shake these all over ice, to further dilute and bring synergy to these ingredients. Please write down the flavor notes of your signature course. You're gonna taste grapefruit juice, dark chocolate, and my favorite note of ginger ale. You're gonna have a medium body for weight, juicy texture, and a beautiful refreshing finish for this hot day of ginger ale. And I'm gonna serve you on this frozen stainless steel sphere to keep your drink cold and preserve more compounds. Please don't drink these yet, only after I call my time. Now, together with teamwork, we were able to elevate your coffee experience. But this type of teamwork happens every single day, in every cafe, every roaster, and every coffee farm. Because this is our dream, guys. Elevating coffee quality through transparency in our industry 
while nurturing our coffee community and team members. Thank you so much for being part of this coffee-loving dream team and time. Woo!